All right, guys, so we have heard about a ton of stuff over the past couple days in the sneak peeks, but one thing we haven't really seen is the raids. It's the competitive thing that's gonna happen every single weekend. Guys, let's go see what this thing is all about. Cool. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back, you guys know what it is. Hey man, I gotta tell you, it's kind of late here. Like, we have just been grinding on these sneak peeks. And uh, as I said to you recently, I haven't shaved and I'm not gonna shave until the update happens, so cool. cool. But guys, right now, you can see up at the top, we are in the raids, or the raid, the first raid. Guys, I've never done this. I know nothing about it, except, yeah, I've worked really hard for these raid medals. In the preview video, they were saying, this is gonna be happening every single weekend. Is it the raid weekend already? Looks like it. Clan capital raids will happen every weekend. But honestly, I have no idea what to expect. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it together. Let's do it right now. So I don't really understand why the top is closed off still. Do we have to start with the other one? I don't know. Let's go to the bottom one. Let's see what happens. Here we go. Okay, so we just went into the first one. Guys, oh, that looks like a lot of metals up there. So yeah, we still have a stupid army here. I love this, this giant mountain golem. Dude is really good. The hog riders... I love them. I don't know if they're as good, but let's go. If you remember, if you saw, or I guess it was our last video, this guy, this mountain golem, just absolutely shreds through everything. I mean, you don't really need to worry about him. Hey, so why don't we get a couple of hogs in here? Yeah. Okay, so this is exactly what I expected to happen. I wasn't sure, but if you get, say, 16% of the base, you get 16% of the loot. I think this is gonna work really good. All right, guys, here we go. So we have air troops here. Can we go over the mountain there? I'm pretty sure you can. Let's see what happens. Here we go. Oh, perfect. I love this. I love this. So I'm gonna hit the rage because we gotta get through this, dude. We gotta go. Keep going, guys, keep going. This is what I was looking for, guys. I know this looks ridiculous because we're just getting absolutely destroyed. That's the point. Okay, so before we go back in, I just wanna check this out. So districts destroyed zero out of seven. So I would assume that's the goal. Cool. Guys, I gotta be honest, this felt really good to clear this whole district. This is gonna be the fun part about this. It's the same thing as Clan Wars, except this is even more of a cooperative thing. I think it's gonna be good. Guys, we did it. Bonus attack earned, so, okay. That's the goal right there. I mean, one more attack, it's huge. Oh, that's right, the heal spell is still there, guys. That makes me so happy every time I go in and see that. It just makes me happy. It's like somebody left you a spell for free. I mean, it was one of your clan mates. In this case, it was me, <laughs> but you know what I mean? So I wonder if there's gonna be a strategy to open up some of the side areas, because I think if, if we were to take out that building right there, I think it would allow us to spawn troops over there. In theory, we could take that out, we could go over here, and all of a sudden somebody could go in from a more favorable angle. In the end, I think brute force is gonna get us, you know, most of the way here, but let's give it a go. You know what's different about this? Everything looks so small. Everything looks like, like you can really zoom out. It's such a big map. It, it feels like you're looking at it from outer space because, I mean, I guess we are. This is just a different sized map. I think it's much bigger, man. I never thought it would be this satisfying. When you take out a building and the spawn zone opens up, watch, it's probably gonna happen here. Yeah, yeah, it like follows you around. I love that. I just love that. I don't know why, I don't know why. Where are you guys going? What? <laughs> That was cool. That was cool. Like they're going through the woods. I love this. Final one, 99. Peace. There it is again, guys. So when you finish a district, you get a bonus attack. Well, there you have it, guys. We finished the district again. We just did 10 attacks or like 11 attacks in a row. That's crazy. We're, we can do 12 right now, just on two accounts. And that's gonna be a lot. This is a lot, but it's not like clan wars where every single attack is super high stakes. You don't wanna mess up. You're worried you're gonna mess up for your clan. This felt chill. This felt just fun. Oh, this one looks so fun. I just love the idea of that bridge there. Is that a wall on the bridge though? Hang on, let's just see what happens here. Hang on. We're getting killed already. I love this. I love this. Goodbye.
So anyway, this was the final attack that we had here. And that's the freeze spell, by the way. Do you guys see that? It's not, it's not even a freeze. It's different. It's called the frost spell. So it does multiple things. It slows things down, but you can also use it as a bridge. So it essentially, yeah, you can see it right there. It freezes the water. That's pretty cool. I wish it was, I, I kind of wish it was just a normal free spell as well, but it's different. It's cool. Yo, is that a heal spell? What is that? That thing looks awesome. Wow. Anyway, guys, I think you get the point. This thing is going to be the main purpose of this, I, I think. I think the raids on the weekend are going to be fun. I've talked about it a lot. I think doing actual normal clash on the weekend can sometimes get old. You don't have as many bases to attack unless you're trophy pushing, which actually you still might have the same problem. And if you're in Legend League, nothing is really different. It's the same thing. But th the weekend can sometimes get a little crowded in clash, so there's not as much loot available or whatever. This is going to give an alternative to that. And unlike the Builder Base, I think you could really have fun over here as a clan. The Builder Base never had anything to do with a clan. There's nothing competitive or cooperative over there. So cool, guys. Let us know how you're doing in the comments below. Leave two for Lulu, three for Melly, and four for Paya. And we'll see you right here tomorrow. What's happening tomorrow? We'll see you guys then. Peace.